for this equation, find the value for each of these functions. So starting off with a, it's just going to be simply 3 times 0 squared plus 2 times 0 minus 4 is going to be equal to 0 because 0 times anything 0 plus 0 minus 4 is equal to negative 4. For b, 3 times 1 squared plus 2 times 1 minus 4. 3 plus 2 minus 4 is equal to 1. For c, negative 1. 3 times negative 1 squared plus 2 times negative 1 minus 4 is 3 minus 2 minus 4, which is equal to negative 3. For d, 3 times negative x squared plus 2 times negative x minus 4, we get 3x squared minus 2x minus 4. For e, negative f of x, this is simply just rewriting this and distributing a minus sign, so it's equal to negative 3x squared minus 2x plus 4. For f, it's going to be equal to 3 times x plus 1 squared plus 2 times x plus 1 plus 4, oh, so minus 4. So we end up with 3x squared plus 2x plus so 6x plus 3 plus 2x plus 2 minus 4. So we get 3x squared plus 8x plus 1. For g, f of 2x, we get 3 times 2x squared plus 2 times 2x minus 4. And we get 3 times 4x squared plus 4x minus 4. So we get 12x squared plus 4x minus 4. And the last one, um, x plus h, so three times x plus h squared plus two times x plus h minus four. Three times x squared plus two x h plus h squared plus two x plus two h minus four. And this simple, so keep on going, 3x squared plus 6xh plus 3h squared plus 2x plus 2h minus 4. Simplifying this, we get 3x squared plus 6xh. Oh, it already is simplified. I didn't realize that. Okay, well, anyway, that's the final solution. That's it.